Ripping up the skies over India's aerospace capital, fighters from India and the world in a deadly aerial dance. But amidst all the sound and fury that only a jet engine can exude, there's a thundering new dawn rising for the Indian Air Force. One that seeks to take decades of legacy dependence on outside fighter deck and replace it with India's own. India today has learned that this ambitious drive is being informally called Mission 470. And the reason for that, in case you hadn't guessed, is that starting February next year, the Indian Air Force will begin receiving the first of 470 fighters designed and built right here in India. Let's take you step by step through this big plan. Things will kick off in February 2024 with the delivery of the first of 83 LCA Tejas Mark 1A fighters, a hugely improved version of the current Tejas in service. Meanwhile, the Indian Air Force will also begin to order 108 LCA Mark II jets, aircraft that are derived from the original Tejas but enormously more capable, with better performance, stronger engines and far superior capabilities. You're familiar with the LCA Tejas, but this is the Mark II and it's actually a vastly different aircraft. It's actually a bigger aircraft. This scale model tells you a little bit about how that final look is going to be. Some big differences. It's a heavier, longer aircraft. As you can see, it has these canard four planes here for greater maneuverability. It actually increases the agility of this fighter. If you look at the weapon systems on board the LCA Mark II, it can actually carry a much larger range and more weapons than the LCA can. Very, very importantly, if you come to the back, you can't really see it here in the model, but the engine that goes on the LCA Mark II is going to be a much more powerful engine on the existing LCA Tejas of the Indian Air Force. While this happens over a decade, India's most advanced fighter in development, the fifth generation stealthy AMCA will come online and begin deliveries of at least 126 units to the Indian Air Force. On a parallel track, the Indian Navy will also begin receiving 100 twin-engine deck-based fighters or TED-BF for its aircraft carriers, fully purpose-built naval jets to meet the Indian Navy's future requirements. Well into the next decade, that translates into 470 Indian-designed, Indian-built fighters for the Indian Air Force and Indian Navy. With Defence Minister Rajnath Singh declaring that three-quarters of India's present and future weapon modernization budgets will be reserved for Indian industry, the future looks bright. But nothing is ever as simple as it looks. As India sets down a path towards Atmanirbhar fighters, can it remain steadfastly on track? Bureau Report, India Today. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.